We're here today to put on a part from a company called California Pony Cars. They make all sorts of decorative and aftermarket parts for the next generation Mustang, which is the 2005 and newer ones. And I tell you what, if you go on their website, cowponycars.com, you'll see what it's all about. But what we got today is this decorative plenum cover that they sent me to put on, and it is a real snap to put on. Let me show you what's going on. Number one, the thing I like about the Cow Pony Cars guys is they send you a real nice instruction sheet. You know, sometimes you get things and the instruction sheet is so vague, it's really difficult to read. Not these guys. They spell it out to you. You know what you got to do ahead of time. You can plan it out. Real good instruction sheet in the package itself. But this plenum is basically going to lay over the top of the engine, kind of cover it up, make it look really cool. And who doesn't like to make their engine look cool? Uh, but let me show you real quick what you got to do. You're going to bend this ground wire that's back here, and you're going to bend it down and swing it out of the way. That's to basically make room for this cover to fit back here. You got a tab here that has a wire on it that you're going to lift off and set to the side. And then you got one over there on the other side too that you're going to lift off and set to the side, which I've already done. In the front here, <clears throat> originally it has these two bolts that hold in this plenum here. And uh, we're going to take those out like I've done already, and we're going to install these supplied studs that's, that uh, they give you. You put both of these in. Now, now that you've done that, I usually take a wrench and just go back over these with a wrench just to snug them down. Not a bad idea to do. Don't go overboard. You're going into either plastic or you're going into aluminum, so it just has to be snug. Now you're going to take this cover and you're going to put it on the top over here and get it inside these two studs. Now it'll slide back. You'll index it on these two studs that were sticking up here in the back. Kind of snap it down in there. Man, that does look good. Now, the next thing you got to do is you're going to put these two little nuts on. Now, what you're going to do is kind of just run them down about halfway. And the reason why you'll run them down halfway is because they also have this little neat accessory that goes over the end of it and it finishes this off. It makes it flow and make it look streamlined into the, into the bellows itself. You'll tighten those two studs up with your gun or your ratchet. And I tell you what, you stand back and look at this bad boy. Now, if you go on their website, cowponycars.com, not only will you find this thing here, but you'll find covers for your master cylinder, covers for your shock towers, covers for your batteries, covers for your radiator. I tell you what, next thing you know, they're going to be selling covers for their covers. It looks that good underneath here. Go to their website, cowponycars.com, and make sure you tell them that the doc sent you.